What's the first day of rehearsal like? It's really chill. It's just kind of like, you know, hey, how are you? Get to know each other, explain the process, you know, show them how to put on their shoes, show them how to oil it, stretching, and then maybe do a little basic, you know, of a dance or two, you know. But it's the first day is pretty, it's like the calm before the storm, you know. You oil your shoes? Yeah, you have to oil them. What? I don't understand. Well, the bottom of the shoe is it's not rubber. It's more like a felt. And sometimes when that hits wood, it's very slick. So you get castor oil and you massage it into the bottom of the shoe and then you have a brush, a really sharp sharp brush, and you brush it out and it makes it stick. Who knew? Yeah, it's, wow. it's and in the back in the backstage room there's like a there's like a big um like a linoleum plat like square on the ground with there's oil everywhere and we squirt the oil on real quick and step in it before we go out and just brush the shoes. Well that's interesting. Yeah. Alright, so you you're having your first rehearsal. How long before you know whether you have a clinker or not? Uh, 10, 15 minutes. You, you just know. You just know straight away. You know whether they're going to be natural, you know if they're going to pick it up quick, or if it's going to be really hard work, or if they're really hopeless. You can tell. Okay, so let's, let's say you've got somebody who's really hopeless. How, how do you psychologically know, uh, uh, handle it, that you've got an entire season coming up? You're a professional. You yeah. want to go out there, and you don't want to look bad, and yet they're not going to be helping you much. Well, th that's the thing. It's not really them about. It's not really about you know them helping us. It's about you know us catering to them and, and guiding them. So I think you have to assess the situation quickly, and then um, you have to be content and happy with it, regardless. What sort of celebrity would would be a good fit for you in terms of attitude, in terms of body type? Um, I've always said the three people that I'd like to have a, uh, as a partner is either Jennifer Aniston just because I think she's awesome and she'd be great body type, like you said. Ellen DeGeneres, because she can actually dance and she's hilarious. And now I think the new one for me is Pippa Middleton. I think that she'd be really good too. And I grew up in England, so I mean, I understand the English. <laughs> Which of those three do you think would be the most talented? Um, well, I've never seen Jen or Pippa move, but Ellen can move, so I think she'd do really, really well.